back once again at another job. Hello viewers. So today uh, we are adding, you can see there's a socket here. So we're just needing to add another socket just a bit along here. We're going to take off these tiles and then we are going to add a metal back box. Uh, trying to draw in reverse when I'm looking at myself is not easy. There you go. Metal back box. Like that. That'll do. Uh, and then a USB double socket. And then underneath here, we're going to add a strip light, LED strip light that's just going to be on a plug top so that the uh, lady here has um, just a bit of extra light above her workspace in this area of the kitchen in her flat. So, tiles are off. As you can see, there's the metal back box there. So we'll just need to place another one on a cable from there and place another one roughly about here. Try and get it the same distance as that existing one is from there. So from that one to that one, we'll mark up and then start installing it. So the wall is chased out, the metal back box is in, screwed to the wall nice and tight and level. All we need to do now is just put a grommet in the existing one and the new one and run some cable and of course, we need to do some tidying up, but I have a rubbish sack, so that should be not too difficult. And of course, we'll do a nice clean tidy up. Uh, no need to make good necessarily. Uh, the, I've got a guy coming and he'll tile over this anyway. So we'll put the socket on and just leave it uh, attached, but ever so slightly just off, and then he can uh, tile around that. So that's the next bit to do. So that's the USB socket in now, and just doing a ZS 0.33. Let's uh, try that again. Just see what uh, what comes up. 0.31. And again, do best of three. Zero point three two. So zero point three 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 one and three two. So that's uh, not bad reading on that. And um, we'll go ahead and do an RCD test as well. Thinking about it, switch it round. Two forty volts at forty nine point nine hertz. Everything seems to be okay. Let's go and reset the RCD then. So it's reached the end of the test. See the word end there. So let's cycle through, see what results we get. Greater than 1,999 milliseconds at half times. 13 milliseconds at one time on the zero degrees of the waveform. 23.1 at the other side of the waveform on one times. 13 on the five times at the zero degrees waveform and 23 at the five times on the 180 degrees on the waveform. So 23 seconds is the figure that we'll write down on our test sheet. So I've just fitted this under cabinet light, LED strip light, Knightsbridge is the brand. They're very good, nice and easy and simple, but uh, do a very good job. And just have a little switch there on the unit as well. Uh, this is just straight onto a plug top makes it easy for the customer, uh, saves running extra cabling and uh, messing up walls. He says, as he's already uh, messed up this bit for running the extra socket. That was one reason for doing the extra socket as well, so she could have this and still have uh, socket space for charging phones or for doing what she needs to do on the worktop. Uh, yes, it does go in front of the thermostat, but that's not an issue because you can just easily detach the under cabinet light. You can easily change the batteries without disturbing that as the batteries go where that British gas sign is. So that's fine, that's easy enough. Uh, I'm not too worried uh, about uh, where that sits like that or for interfering heat wise either because with it being LED, it doesn't give a great deal of heat out. So it, it should be okay. And here's the results. So just switch on and it provides a lot of light across the worktop area, which is 
uh, going to be pleasing for the client. That's one thing she was wanting, just a bit of extra light around that work top space, given that it's a small kitchen, versus the light she would have to work with uh, without. And so that's it for today's job. I uh, just want to say thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video as well. That helps out a great deal. Also follow Acer DC Electrics on Twitter and Instagram. And until the next time, thank you very much for watching.